Hey everyone, it's Laura from the blog OurEarlyHouse.com and today I'm going to show you how to make a very simple milk bath. So I gotta be honest, the reason why I even decided I wanted to try a milk bath was I was really drawn in by all the pretty maternity pictures that people take in the milk bath. I'm sure you guys have seen them floating around Pinterest. They are so beautiful and I was kind of, didn't even know what they were sitting in. And then I did a little research, found out they were taking milk baths. And yes, they make really, really pretty pictures, but they also have a lot of really good benefits for your skin. So we're gonna be using just powdered milk, some baking soda. You can also use Epsom salt if you want to, that's totally optional. And then I'm gonna put in some lavender essential oil. And this bath soak is really good for soothing the skin, it's good for skin irritations, and it's really good for relaxing and calming you. So be a really good soak to do at nighttime before bed or just after a long stressful day. This recipe is really, really easy and I'm just gonna use three ingredients, so this is just two cups of powdered whole milk and it's really important to get whole milk because it has more nutrients in it and also the fat in there is going to be really really good for your skin so getting a whole milk powder is much better than like a skim milk or anything like that and I have this one that I have here linked down in my profile or down in my description below and I like this one because it is made with no antibiotics and it's GMO free then I'm just gonna add in a half of a cup of baking soda. And then like I said, if you want to add in some Epsom salt here, just a quarter of a cup of Epsom salt, that will make it even more nourishing for your skin. And then I'm just going to stir up my dry ingredients. And then you have the option of adding in an essential oil. Now of course, you don't have to add in the essential oil, but it's going to add a lot of benefits, especially with this lavender, because I am kind of going for that calming, relaxing, bath soak here and so i'm just going to do 10 drops of lavender it's also going to really put in a really pretty floral scent to this and then i'm just going to stir this up to make sure it's kind of combined well with all the ingredients and that's it it's that easy to make and then when you go to use it you're just going to put in a quarter of a cup to a half of a cup depending on how much water you have in your bathtub into the tub of warm water and just stir it around just you know with your hand or with your foot to kind of get it to blend into the water and then you can just get in and soak in it this makes a really fun little gift for somebody you can just fill up a little mason jar Anything with an airtight lid is fine for storage, but I thought these were kind of fun for even like a little gift for someone. And this would be enough for two baths for them. Or you can put it into a larger mason jar depending on if you're keeping it for yourself or if you want to gift it to. So that's it guys, super, super simple recipe that has a lot of great benefits for your skin and also for your mind and just emotional and stress levels and all that good stuff. I have a printable label that you guys can get for this which I have linked down in my description below. You can just print it off. It's completely free just so then you have, you know what's in here and I also have the recipe on there so if you decide to remake it, you have the label there and also a little gift tag if you do decide to give these as gifts. This would make a perfect gift for Mother's Day, Valentine's Day, Christmas, really anything. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I get out two new videos every single week on essential oil education, natural remedies, and healthy recipes. Thank you so much for stopping by our early house.